welcome to the stretch court off the wall ducky battle. In today's match, we're pitting the young upstart against the old man. Their chosen ducky will be used to mark their distance in the final encounter. Each competitor will receive three practice push-offs to refine their technique, followed by the final confrontation. Our young swimmer will enter the natatorium first. Despite the tension of the stretch cord, her first effort takes her well past the flags. Her second attempt utilizes a slower, more undulating dolphin motion. However, it comes up short of the yellow lane marker. The crowd is hushed as her third undertaking propels her way past the yellow lane marker. Even a blind man could see that it was easily her best effort. Let's look closer at the technique utilized on her third attempt. One, two, three, four dolphins followed by some hard freestyle kick. She looks ready for the finals. Over three decades her senior, it is now the old man's turn. His first effort is shallow and falls well short of the yellow marker. His second attempt, better depth than more distance. On his third attempt, he runs out past the yellow marker, but he uses an arm stroke to do it. That dog won't hunt in the finals. Unlike his younger competitor, the quadragenarian was rather inconsistent during his practice runs. Did he hold something back for the finals? And they're off. Dolphin, dolphin. Oh, an early arm stroke by the old man. Prior to the first arm stroke, the young upstart is clearly out front, well past the yellow lane marker. But how did the judges see it? The duckies never lie. No, the duckies never lie. Primarily, this was just a fun way to get my daughter to work on her walls. I had her experiment to see what ratio of dolphin kicks to freestyle kicks helped her get the most power off the wall. She'll still need to continue to refine this in practice. Groan, I roll, before trying it in a meet.